Coach Jonathan here. Welcome to another daily coaching video. Today is Saturday, February 1st. I'm smiling. I cannot believe a month has gone by already. One twelfth of 2020 is done. So if you've been kind of getting a little too laid back on your habits, today's a great day to refocus and recommit. All that matters is today. So don't worry about looking in the rearview mirror. That is a waste of time today. Win today, win today, and repeat. Sorry it's so loud in the background. Alexander, our 12-year-old, and Benjamin, our 10-year-old, had sleepover parties last night, and then Adeline, our little cutie four-year-old, all three of them are playing with, it, with uh, Alex and Ben's two friends. They're playing this game, Inflection. Karen's like, you're gonna film a video. I'm like, it's all good. Have, their kids are having a blast. So all of you who are parents, you can relate to that. So it's Saturday, weekends are awesome, right? Make sure to nail your Saturday no excuses workout. Energy up, mood up, stress down. The best version of you is on the other side of those 30 minutes. So pick a coach, pick a time and get after it. I think there's four or five coaches live this morning or you can join myself or one of the other coaches on recording. By the way, I am done with my break from the live videos. I cannot stay away any longer. I love it, I miss it. So I am back as of Monday doing my live workouts. I'm not gonna do 9 a.m. like I've been doing on Monday and Friday. Instead, I'm gonna do 10 a.m. Eastern. So look forward to joining me. The weather's actually been surprisingly, I wouldn't call it warm, but warmer. So we'll see what happens as far as being outside. So today's focus may be the most important thing we've discussed. So uh, please really pay attention, put your radar up for this, which is, are you an energy provider or an energy taker? Now your negative voice can say, oh, I don't like that word taker. I'm your coach, right? Sometimes coaches deliver tough, candid message. So this is one of them. Are you an energy provider or an energy taker? When you come into a room and you bring your vibe, do you show up in a way that positively impacts the other people? Do they feel better when they're around you or do they feel worse when they're around you? I'll mention something, most people are not neutral. You're either a provider or a taker when it comes to your energy. Now this is an opportunity, this isn't a negative thing. So if you are an energy taker as of right now, let's change that. And the simplest path to do that is to ask yourself, what's my own energy level from zero to five, zero you're dragging, five you're on fire. If you answer a four or a five, you're an energy provider, right? If you're a three, you're kind of neutral. If you're a two or one, you're an energy taker. So when you ask yourself that question, not about taker or provider, what's my energy level? If you say it's four or five, don't change anything. Keep doing what you're doing, your vibe's on, awesome, right? You're making people feel elevated and lifted around you. If you're a three or less, then the natural next question is, what can I do to crank up my energy? Do I need water, do I need nutrients, do I need positive content, do I need additional sleep? Do I need a workout? What do I need to elevate my game? Now I'll mention one thing, this is my favorite hat, life is good. It was given to me as a gift from Holly and Heather, this world-class mom and daughter who come to the wellness retreat in Vermont every year. They are major energy providers, but they're quiet. So a lot of people get confused, their negative voices, well, you don't talk 100 miles an hour, you're not loud or whatever. That's not what an energy provider, an energy provider is a certain vibe and spirit. It has nothing to do with whether you're an extrovert or introvert or whether you talk 100 miles an hour or you're more chilled, right? It just means what's your vibe when you come into a room. And most importantly, what's your energy and your vibe when you're hanging out with your home team, which is the most important team? This is a tremendous opportunity. A lot of you wanna drop weight, which is great. You wanna get fit, you wanna get healthy. I'm into all of that. But most importantly, we wanna be our best selves for our family. We wanna be energy providers. All right, think about this concept after you absolutely pulverize your Saturday No Excuses workout. Then tonight, stay on top of the win tomorrow checklist, and I will see you on Sunday morning.